so um I'm back and uh, computer set timer for 10 minutes sorry about that it's just to keep track of time so in this video I wanted to talk about anger um, so anger is a is a pretty, you know, big and kind of hard thing to manage sometimes, right? I think we can all agree. Anger management is difficult. Well, I've heard, so, so the thing about anger, right, is it takes, like, control, I guess, sometimes. So, like, we, we don't even realize it, right? We'll just do something instinctually out of anger, and then we end up getting used to being mad. That's, you know, it's weird to think you can make a habit of something so negative, right? Nobody wants to make a habit out of something so negative, but that's what happens. You can make a habit of something really, really negative, and uh, unpin this. And, um, I mean, this much you can really do about it except for fix it right like anger anger is hard to deal with and unless you actually put in the effort to try to change something you're going to keep getting angry and that's something I struggle with learning especially right I've been struggling a lot with um, with just not getting mad all the time. And that, that, you know, I, it's something I need to work on. I get super mad super easily. It, it doesn't take much to make me mad, alright? I've been playing Fortnite these past few days on and off. And for as little as I play, you would think I wouldn't have a win yet because I've barely been playing, right? But despite that, reasonable inference um for some reason i'm angry at myself for not winning yet i still don't have my victor umbrella this season and it's just been getting on my nerves and is it really something that should be no it's freaking video game bro the fact that it makes me mad is well stupid video games should be fun video games should be enjoyable for some reason all of us get angry right I mean, have you all seen my rage compilation? I have an entire compilation of me just getting mad at, at this game. This one game. And it was over the course of... I think it was just the first three seasons of Chapter 4. And it's just three minutes of me just yelling. Alright? It's a funny video. It is a very funny video. But... You have to wonder, like... When is it too much? Like, I'm angry right now that I just died. And I want to shout and scream and say, Hey, I have to sit really close to my TV screen because this microphone, it, the way it, it is, the stand is super short. I, I just can't reach out that far. But, you know, I have enough self-control to resist that for now. But as I get progressively more angry, my self-control kind of slips away a bit. And I think that's a problem that every person has. This isn't exclusive to me. But my breaking point seems to be a little bit sooner than others. And, um... Yeah. So, this is... Obviously, this is a problem that pretty much everyone faces. Getting way too angry way too easily. We all wish that we just couldn't get angry at such petty things, right? And that we would only get angry about things that are actually... Um that are actually worth getting mad about, right? But it's difficult. That's difficult. That is that's hard. Cuz man, when things just don't go your way, you just want to scream. And that that's partially that's probably an OCD thing, right? As well. That that goes hand in hand with how angry I get is you know, with this with OCD, it's like everything must go my way or to the wrong way. And if it doesn't go my way and it's wrong, then 
Um, it's the end, right? Nothing else can ever go my way again if this doesn't go my way. And that's not true, right? I think we all know that's not true at all. But for some reason, I think, it, I seem to subconsciously think it is. This didn't go my way, so nothing else will. Right? Not everything works out in life. And, you know, this, 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 we're, by the way, we're not just talking about video. We're just talking about everything. Right? Anything can make you angry. I, oh my gosh. Dude, I'm not even appearing online. Oh, wait, look at that. There's a prime example. That minor inconvenience just, like, really made me mad. That shouldn't be that anger inducing. You know? That's a minor inconvenience. But guess what? It kind of made me really angry. How do we prevent that? Well, I mean, anger management skills obviously are huge. But, um, how do you get anger management skills? And that's. Not only that, but how do you get yourself to want to manage it? Like, if you don't want to change, you're not going to. You have to want to change as well. Change in general is difficult. I kind of had a whole video going over change. Um, but anger seems to go hand in hand with change. Right? You know, this thing is different than I wanted. It's changing plan. This is bad. This is, you know, everything's falling apart. Everything's collapsing. It's like, no. It just means that it didn't work out the way you wanted. It doesn't mean everything's collapsing, but when you're being irrational, you know, as all humans do, it's difficult to believe that. Even if you know it's true, it doesn't mean you believe it. And that's, that kind of sucks, right? That sucks a lot. We are... We're closed-minded. We don't accept change as much as we should, right? <coughs> that, that sucks. I mean... What am I supposed to do, right? Am I just supposed to... You know, I, I am I supposed to expect the world to change? No. And I, you know, I need to change with the world. I don't need the world to change for me. And that's another problem: is the world not changing can also cause anger as much as change can. Right? Um, just anything not going your way. Everybody knows that. It just. The discussion arises in how difficult it is to manage anger, right? When anger is not necessary and it makes your case worse, you know, how do you stop it from happening? Because unnecessary anger is annoying to everyone, even the person getting angry. The per people who get angry don't exactly enjoy getting angry. I mean, you think they just take pride in how angry they get? No. You know, that video that I ridicule myself, basically. Um, it is not me taking pride in how mad I get. It is me thinking it's funny how stupid it is, right? So even I'll acknowledge that it's dumb. It's, it's a really stupid thing to get as mad as I do sometimes. Or anyone. Um, so obviously, how do you fix that? Um, you know, anger, another thing anger does is it can lead to, like, it can cause, like, it, for instance, if you, uh, have a heart condition, it raises your odds of just having literally, you know, a, a million different things happen, right? That's bad. Oh, there's windows. Huh. I didn't know there was like actually windows for us. They're not they're still not see-through. Um yeah, back to what I was saying. So yeah, it it's it helps no one to get angry at something. 
because that's just that's feeding into a primal version of humanity that that doesn't need to exist anymore. we don't need to be competitive anymore that serves no purpose computer stop it serves no purpose to be competitive now but yet we as a species are for some reason for some weird reason we're extremely competitive about kind of petty things Food and water are things to be competitive about, not how to run your country. That's stupid. Who cares? I mean, obviously, I guess it wouldn't be who cares, but rather just don't mistreat your people, right? Oh, here comes anger again. This is what I mean. Now I'm getting angry because now I'm thinking about these stupid countries that mistreat their people. Which, that's a topic for another day. Like, what the frick, guys? Have you no common decency? It... It doesn't, it's not very hard to have the morality to realize what North Korea does to its people is horrible. Like this, it is inexcusably bad. And, you know, you, you have to wonder how that, how, how we got into a place like this. But, it's a topic for another day. What, why are all my... They're all unbound. It's just on Builder Pro. Okay. Hey, y'all. I'm stuck in this car. Dang it. I'm stuck in this car. See, this is where my anger ensues. There's nothing I can do about this, though. This isn't... How do I change... Bro, how do I get out? I'm stuck! Nothing's bound! Y'all seeing this? Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh yeah, I can't freaking boost. I'm trying, bro. Get me out of this stupid car. Stop inviting me. Holy crap. I'm not online! Look, oh, you can see what I mean. Please don't. How? How is your center of mass that far down? Okay, I'm getting annoyed. I, I can't get out of this car. Can I switch seats at least? No, no, because that's not found. That's right. Thank you. Alright, let's just destroy this abomination. Yeah, yeah. That's what you get for doing that. Do you know what I mean? Anger. Y'all just got pretty prime example I think um wasn't an intentional one I'll tell you that much um yeah anger woohoo we all love anger so much um Y'all about to see how angry I'll get when when I freaking lose this game. Because we already know it's going to happen. I'm terrible at this game. I still don't have my victory, umbrella. So y'all already know that I want to win, but can't. Um, so yeah, if y'all want to see an example of me getting really mad. Also, why is the lobby dying so slowly? Well, yeah, back to what I was saying. It's hard to manage your rivalry. Um, I'd say like the biggest thing that plays into poor anger management. How are you going so fast? How? How is that possible? How is he going so quick? Oh, he's gliding. Stay out of the zone. Okay, is my man's coming this way? He is. Um, 
Yeah, it's it's hard to manage anger. Um, and that's because self it requires a lot of self control. It requires a lot of patience. That's a huge one. Is patience. <coughs> And unfortunately, it's been hard for me to get patience lately because I haven't had time to play. Yeah, look, I, I can't freaking. None of my vehicle things are bound. I, I, I don't know what's up. Builder Pro. Builder Pro. Thank you. Um, so I'm back. Don't know what happened. But it has done that before. It'll just randomly, my screen will go black for no reason. Can't see anything. Recording will just stop. It's the best thing ever. It says charge is unbound, but that's what I'm doing right here. Whatever. Okay, um, so we're down to six people now, and I, I'm the only one in both circles. I might be the only one that has them. I am. I'm the only one that has future storm circles revealed. Okay, so these guys don't know that I'm actually holding the best position right now. Five people. Popped his tire. I know he's in that car. I, it, he's just sitting there. I can hear the engine. Buddy, what are you doing? Silly bones. Now you get in the passenger seat. Got it. How does he. Bro, is he stupid? Did he. I shot him from in here. I shot out his tire. Have fun with that one. Oh, shoot. I don't think I should have engaged. Oh, it's okay. Apparently, he doesn't want to either. So, how do you combat the shield? Isn't it just shooting them a lot? Doesn't that, like, break it or something? Okay, we're in top four. Um, man, okay, so this is awkward no build. I'm in a very awkward position in general. Ooh. Okay, so I got him low, so I did help with that kill a bit. But I think that was a necessary kill for him to get. I don't care if I get that kill. All that matters to me is that he's dead. Okay, how do you combat that, bro? How do you combat that shield? Fortnite, why did you make it take so many shots to disarm it? Why did you even add it? That's my question. Don't add stuff like that. Okay, bye.